on guys welcome back to another video and as you guys already saw by the title of this video i'm pretty sure or i'm gonna be doing an unboxing today and i had to open up the box because me and my dad have the same name so i had to double check and make sure that this was my package and not his so the box is already opened but so i already know what's inside of here and you guys already know what's inside of here by the title but also don't mind this this is just my sliding tape i reuse it so i don't use as much but I'm so sorry. I'm using like I don't have anything to hold up my phone, so I'm kind of using like a yoga mat I found in the garage. All right, just shut up one second. Okay, guys. So set this all up. You just aren't gonna be able to see my face. Okay, so let's go ahead and open this up. So by the looks of it, it's packaged with the brown paper. You just set that aside for right now. And so what I have here are the recaps for the Smith Scab Elite. And these are the knee pads that I have. They're pretty good. I recommend these for sliding over Protex or uh, Razor knee pads or whatever. But the reason I have one black and one red is because they actually only had one quantity of the black and I wanted to be able to have black for Halloween for my costume. So it would blend in. So uh, I went ahead and I got two so I could actually like, slide on the street and not break through my recaps in like the first three days. Because as you can see with like the knee pads, they're kind of shiny and stuff. Because I've been sliding in my garage, which is actually where I'm filming this right now. But let's go ahead and just open these up. So it kind of looks like the same idea that they do with or the same like opening up sort of thing that they do with the uh, the knee pads which is just like a you pull this like little clear thing out and then you just open up the expanding thingy these are the recaps they're just like big plastic shells and they actually get held on by these things which are like sticky strips which I thought was pretty cool. That's how uh, thick the recaps are. So let me go ahead and take out my knee pads for you super fast. Uh, I'll do that, or I'll go ahead and take them out and then I'll uh, film from there. Okay, so here's my knee pads out of the thing. This is two, so now let me just go ahead and unstrap these and then I'll we'll go from there. Okay guys, so now that they're all done, I actually just wanna review something with you guys and tell you why I would prefer these over Protex. So the whole reason I prefer these over Protex is because of what they call the butterfly strap, which is unlike a Protex, let me grab it super fast. Okay, so I have it. This was actually my knee pad from last year. So unlike a Protex where you have to actually slip your leg in, like this, and then you do like the straps, this one, it actually like opens up to put your leg in. So it's all just Velcro, and then, sorry, there's so many straps, but, and then, like you just, put the velcro straps on or the butterfly straps on and then it's just like the standard knee pad with the uh the two other velcro straps like the uh one like stretchy one and then the one that just folds over itself so we're like these two straps where they go like this but and then this is what the recap does it goes over the top of it and it sits like Supposed to, supposed to just chill like this, but that doesn't look right because there's a lot of room underneath. I think maybe you're supposed to like push it down. I think. Kind of seems like that's what you're supposed to do. You just push it down like that, and then put it on. So I'm actually gonna go and I'm gonna look up how to do this super fast because I have no clue, and then we'll go from there. Okay, so I actually couldn't find anything, so I'm just gonna try this out. Uh, I'm just gonna try to st take off the sticky tabs. These like, sticky strips. Uh, I'll get back to you guys once I have these all off. Okay, I have them all off now. Um, I don't see anything that says like left or right. So. I'm just gonna think that what you do, let's do this. 
Make sure everything is lined up and you push on. And make sure everything is pushed on very good and well. Make sure that nothing comes off. And that's your recap. So, I know this doesn't look like the best, but this is honestly just for, like, training and everything for me and practicing. And then once Halloween comes around, I'm going to swap over to these bad boys, the black ones. Which, honestly, I prefer. If there were two black ones, I would have definitely got the two black ones. But I could only have one red and one black. So, yeah, guys. That's what they look like. This just looks really weird red on red. But it's okay, right? So, yeah, guys. I just showed you how to put on one of the recaps. And this is also, like, the review on it. Honestly, I say it's pretty good. I mean, I'm pulling pretty hard and nothing. It's not, like, coming off or anything. I just did that to so just, because it wasn't like that far on in the beginning before I started pulling. Uh, but yeah, guys, that is going to be the end of this video. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you guys did enjoy, please don't forget to smash that like button. Comment down below what you guys would love to see next. I'm down to do anything. Um, especially if it's sliding related, because I'm probably going to be sliding a lot. And uh, yeah, guys. Uh, like I said, comment down below what you'd like to see next. Subscribe, turn on post notifications. And see you next time. Stay random. Peace.